For context, in a previous video, I talked about this new study circulating that outlined how ADHD medications do not inherently improve grades. So you can follow the comment if you want to learn more about that. But this comment touches on a bigger issue that's way too much to cover in one video. But real briefly, it's about how the education system is not set up for neurodivergence. For neurodiverse individuals, it often doesn't work. And I believe what's really demonstrated by this research is how much our educational models and methods are only aligned with very neurotypical standard ways of learning, and even then, frankly, not very well. And so simply being able to sit still longer likely will not improve grades, and I think that's probably why we saw the results that we did. If we want to see real change, we need to change how we do instruction. And if you talk to teachers, most teachers I know, including myself, agree that the way we teach on a standardized level with these standardized tests and so on is terrible. And the good teachers I know all find different ways to engage their students in nuanced, multimodal, multi-sensory ways of learning to make the subject matter matter. And I think if you think back to the teachers that impacted you the most, they're the ones who did something a little bit different. They're the ones who made the material come alive because what they were doing is really making it relevant. So that's the best answer I can give you and thanks for the comment.